everybody, it's Dana Joy from God Joy Creations. Today I wanted to show you some items that I picked up recently from Paper Tray Inc. I really love their, their products and I like their, um, it's called Phrase Play Sets. So let me show you what I picked up. So this is the packaging that everything comes in. I think this is adorable because you can really reuse this envelope for a ton of things. So I'm not going to throw this away at all. So one of the sets that I picked up, this one is called the Phrase Play Number 6. And you get all of these sentiments in this set. And it works along with the sentiment, uh, the die plate. So it says sending you, and then it has a little opening right here. And the opening is where you can go ahead and add all of these sentiments in. So I really like these sets. I, also ha I already have a few that I picked up from before. So this one here says hello and then it leaves a spot for a sentiment. And again, there's what, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 sentiments that you can put into this little thing here. So this is phrase play three. And then I have um, this one here, which says enjoy. Again, a lot of opening here that you can go ahead and put your sentiment in. So just some of the sentiments here. Let me see, I think I have it upside down. Nope, I have it the right way. Is like enjoy this small token, enjoy this special moment, enjoy your birthday. So there's tons of sentiments in here that you can use. And I have also picked up the uh, phrase play number one, and that is you are my, again, a blank area for you to put a sentiment. And then this one here says, you know, sunshine, my happy place, my reason to smile. I really love these sets and these matching dies from uh, Paper Tray Inc. Another one that I picked up was this adorable little baby one. Can you see the polka dots on that? I love this set. And this one had a cute little uh, baby die that came with it. And since I have a lot of baby cards I need to be making rather soon, I thought this would be a perfect set to pick up. I also picked up this one here. I really love these large dies because there's so many things that you can do with it. I mean, you can cut out the sentiment and put different color paper behind it, or actually you can cut it out and then fill in each one with a different color. So this one says grateful for you and all that you do. Very, very nice um, die. And they're, they're, they're pretty thin and very strong. So I really enjoy these. Now the next one I'm going to show you, and I have to add a link to this one. This actually makes a cell phone cover case. So a lot of people have been doing this with felt. So like I said, I haven't made one yet because I need to purchase some felt. So that's, you know, another excuse to spend a little bit of money. Um, but this makes a gorgeous cell phone case. So this um, is just like the, the outside of the case with some basic stuff. But I also picked up this one here, which has like little embellishments that you can stitch on to your cell phone case. So here we have like some diamonds and some chevrons with like a little heart and then lines and then like little pointed arrows. And from what I can see is that each one of these little holes is where you can actually stitch. Um, so, you know, get everything put together. So I really like this. Um, and I can't wait to play with this. I just need to make sure that I get myself some felt to start this one. Another thing that I did pick up that is not paper tray related, but as soon as I saw it, I knew I had to have it, was this set here from Art Impressions. I love these two ladies here, because this is like me, my sisters, me and my girlfriends, we're forever doing this. And I love the sentiment, sentiments. They're forget, um, forget two peas in a pod, we're more like uh, two nuts in a tree. It's exhausting being this hilarious. I don't know how we do it. And I laugh so hard I had tears running down my life. Now that's that's me and my sisters. We laugh so hard that we are literally crying. So this is like a perfect set for me. And while I was out spending a little bit of money, I headed on over to Simon Says Stamp. They had a great deal on their ink pads. I believe they were 40% off, I think. So let me show you some of the colors that I picked up. So here I got the um, lavender one. What I like about these, these stamp sets are really, really juicy. So there's tons of color in these stamp sets. So I got the lavender, I got the blue um, violet, I have the lemon chiffon, the sunshine, the peel orange, I got the burnt orange, I also got I got the dog pink, 
the cotton candy, the schoolhouse red, uh, lipstick red. I really love this color. That's a gorgeous red color. And yes, there's more. Let me move those out of the way. And then I got the surf blue, the sea glass, the Audrey blue, the island blue. Love this color as well. The soft navy. Move these out of the way. Then I got the green apple, the mint julep, the green leaf, the olive, midnight green. I, this shows up absolutely gorgeous. And then last but not least is the dark chocolate, the khaki, smoke, fog, slate. I love this color gray. And of course, I got the regular black. Now, as you know, I keep all of my stamp colors on a ring. So let me just go ahead and move these out the way. And I went ahead and added the colors to my ring. So I think I start like right here. So these are how some of the colors look when they're all stamped out. I really love all of these colors. And what I'm thinking about doing is I have a lot of stamping up colors that I just don't use a lot anymore. So I'm thinking about going ahead and doing a giveaway on my blog. So keep following me on my blog because I'm going to do a pop-up giveaway. The one thing I pride myself on doing is if I have stamp supplies that I don't use as often as I thought I was, or I have purchased them on kind of a whim and then realized I had multiples of it, I like to give them away. So I'm going to start doing a little pop-up blog candy on my blog. So stay tuned for some of that because I always believe that if you have good craft products and you're not using them, why not share them with somebody? I, I know a lot of people, you know, give them the goodwill or stuff like that. But I really like to have my followers, you know, join in on having a little fun with products that I have used. But also I love to see what you get to create with them. So this is my haul for today. Thank you guys for stopping by. Um, don't forget to follow me on my blog and my YouTube channel, and I'll see you guys soon. Bye-bye.